Tom Norcross, president of Load King Trailers, and today we're going to talk a little bit about the Load King 2060 bottom dump. Of course, Load King, it's called the originator for one reason, one reason only. We brought the first belly dump to market. We still build the same great bottom dump. The only thing we've changed is we've made the price more competitive to go out and capture the market share that we once had. To go over some of the features and benefits of the 2060, we're going to talk a little bit about the rubber bush fifth wheel plate and then if you'll see in here we have the grease zerks as we all know many people don't ever detach from the truck the truck from the bottom dump so what we did is put the grease zerks here to make sure the fifth wheel is always greased we also made sure our glad hands are separated so they're not on top of each other here we have the seven way for the trailer then we go here for the four way this trailer and most every bottom dump we stock is equipped with an infinite gate control this allows you to operate from the cab the infinite gate control. So you turn on the gates, then you can open the gate at any width you want from inside the cab or around to the back, which we'll talk about later. And then this is your hot and ground for the tarp. Also wanted to point out the front fenders. They are welded on. We, everyone we bring in in stock, we do the front fenders on. Many of our competitors, they're an option. We feel they're necessary. If you want to delete them, you can. But again, on our stock units, we go standard with front and rear fenders. Wanted to point out a few more details which make a load king a load king, which means our customers hang on to these trailers for 20 years, then they trade them and they go on to their next life. Some of the things we do is our tubular steel here. We come off, brace in the corners. We use diffuser plates everywhere that we have welds to diffuse that, prevent cracking. Then you can see here on our gate ends, Every bushing here is greasable. From here, this bushing greasable. As you can see on both sides, we have the drop pin legs for weight. And then when you want to adjust your gate openings, it's as easy as pulling the pin on front and back and finding the perfect slot so you get the gate set just right for whatever width you want to open them. Again, you can leave them in one spot. We also have the infinite gate control, which we will continue to talk about as we move through the trailer. You can see here the cylinder is protected behind the gates and then behind there we'll talk about the lower hopper extension which is again a bolt-on option which we put on all our stock trailers. Okay and right here is what I like to call the money shot. This has been a part of Load King since the very beginning. This is our cast iron corner casting. This diffuses any crackings. This is obviously the high stress point right here at the corner of your hoppers. I also want to talk again you can see where our cylinder is mounted, protected behind the gates. We also have the lower hopper extension. This is truly the things that make a Load King a Load King and really do separate us from any of our competitors. On every stock trailer we have, we are standard with the infinite gate control. I've talked about it several times. Again, allows you to open your gates from two inches to fully open. Everything in here is tucked nice and neat. You won't see any wiring exposed. And pun intended, I really gotta hand it to the guys. We've got this handy walk-along control which keeps your people safe when they're working on a highway job doing asphalt. You stand safely away from the trailer and you can operate the gates. Once you're done, stores right back in here. Everything is nice, neat, concealed. You see these holes here, we call it an anti-theft door. We actually have a latch a door here with a piano hinge, comes up here. You can lock it if you want to. Okay, here we are at the back of the trailer with our heavy-duty push block couple things about it. It's a bolt-on design with a bolt-on ICC. If you damage just the ICC bumper, you don't need to buy the complete unit. Another reason we bolt it on, can and will get damaged. Also, we have these cutouts here if you want to run the air and electric to the rear. Simply unbolt this, put on your pinnel hook, you could run in a double scenario. Look forward, you see the 60 gallon air tank which feeds the gate operation. You can see we have rubber bushings at all four corners to keep the vibration down. Look just ahead of that, you see the tubular steel coming off the hopper, just like in the front. You won't find a better trailer. It's the same trailer we've made since the 1960s. We've just made it more competitive, and we're going to go out and capture all the market share that we once had. 